Welcome back to Space Engineers, folks. We are almost ready to start moving over to a permanent base. Uh, Hunchback dropship is moving away from us. That's good. So let's just finish up the ship real quick and then start moving over and building an actual base. So we'll build all this stuff. And can't do that one. Never mind. I can always take the landing gear off, do it and then put it on again if I want. But right now I don't really care. I just want to get this done so we can start building an actual base with better machines and stuff and get some defenses up. All right, so that's some of it done. Let's stick in some, oh, a little bit of vertigo there. Some more um, could actually let's just do this. We're going to need to build these guys immediately. And these guys, I guess, we might as well. This one I don't actually want there. Okay, let's do the other side as well, so that it's even. And right now we don't need it to be a, a mining ship, even though it is going to be one. So I'm not going to bother with putting drills and stuff on it just yet. And we could actually, let's do that, build them up here. So and all of this isn't actually necessary either, I'm just doing it to make it at least look somewhat completed I think that is that time right nope okay and let's swell these guys up You know what, let's say that this is good enough for now. It's not a pretty ship by any means, but it's functional. And it can only barely connect. It, it is connected, but it doesn't look connected. And I think that's because of those engines. So I think we're going to have to move them out a little bit. And that's okay. So, all right. But for now, Let's see, what do we have? We have a little bit of steel plate. Oh, we have a, have a lot of steel plate. Well, a lot and a lot is a wrong word, but there is some. Uh, wastewater, we don't want. Let's put all of these organics together. So what we want to do is we want to move all of this stuff over to these medium cargo containers. So if we grab, why? Come on! Oh, I'm full. Uh, dang it! I want it to go in there.
So we'll move all this stuff over. And we'll actually fill this up as well. Should do that automatically. Yep. Right, so let's grab all of this. No, not that. Uh, grab all of this. This, this. Uh, don't really need to grab that stuff yet. We do need all of this stuff. Where we can fit. And let's stick these things in here. Okay. And there's more. A lot more. And tell it to go in here. Okay. And more. Tell it to go in here. And we need more steel plate. Need to make a lot more steel plate. And we need a lot more construction components and motors. So let's go to production and say make a thousand steel plate. Make 500 construction components. Make 500 motors. Make 100 grids, 200 power cells, some displays, 400 computers, some small steel tubes, some large steel tubes, and some bulletproof glass. Oh, and some girders. I think that was a little bit too many girders, but never mind. Oh, and some interior plate. Okay. I think that will do. Let's grab whatever there is of steel plate and stick it in here and fly over and start working on our new base. Uh, let's fill this up while we're here. Can we actually basic assembler tools? We can make hydrogen bottles. Let's make a couple of those. Okay. Let's grab the rest of the steel plates are there. All right. That's it. We are ready to go start making our permanent home. Uh, 281 meters. Let's just go check this unknown signal while we're here. Not that far away. And who knows, maybe there's something useful in it. So, let's have a look. A badger grinder. Okay. Oh, there's some pretty useful stuff in here. It's good. Okay. Grind it down, get the rest of the steel plates and stuff. And now we really are going to head over. And start building our permanent base. So there. Turn those on. Uh, let's see. How much power do they actually have in them? So not a lot. Not a lot. Ah, oh, it's this, these ones. Ah, oh, okay. They have pretty decent 
I'm out, so that's good. All right, so turn the gyros on, turn the engines on, and we're off. So let's head over to home base. Start building. I love flying around in this game. So much fun. And up. Let's land here. And we'll say you. We almost there, I wonder. Would be nice with a camera. Don't think we can make that yet, though. So, there, we're locked. Turn those on recharge. And there we go. And we're gonna build a base down there. So, we can grab as much. Why can't I grab that out of there? Well, let's grab it out of here. Why can't I do that? That's a little annoying. To say the least. And quite weird. Can I switch it over to another con cargo container? Oh, uh, maybe it's because I turned the power off. I'm guessing that's why. So let's set those to auto and try it out. Yeah, that was it. Now let's just check how much battery time we have. 23 days. So. I think we'll be fine. All right. So let's start building. We'll build, I think, here to start with. And this will be fine. And we'll build a little bit up in the air so that people can't just walk in. So something like that. And we'll build a first floor. Actually, this is a bad idea. Right now, anyway. Uh, for these blocks. Because... Let's... I want... Heavy armor blocks, so that they can't just get destroyed in a single shot. I think... Um, Hmm. Let's do that. All right, so this is heavy armor block. And facing that way, I think. Yeah. All right. Because we're, we're basically going to have four pillars uh, supporting our entire base. Whoops. Don't go too far, dude. I'm gonna need ya. Okay. So let's build. Ah. 
a little bit annoying when you do that. And it's going to be a pretty pretty big base, I think. Well, I don't know what constitutes a big base in this game, but in my mind, I think it's going to be a pretty big base. Uh, see how many blocks was that? It's going to be hard to count. One, two, three, four, five, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one. All right, that's fine. Let's come down. And make another foot or another pillar for the base. Upside down to get that one in. There. Okay. So that's going to be the back wall. And we're going to make it a double wall, but inside and the floor only needs to be light blocks, not heavy blocks. And that's gonna save a lot of material. So, get this built. The, it's only the back wall that's gonna be a double wall. The others don't need to be. Oops, did I miss one there? I did. Having holes in the floor is not a good thing. And then just to indicate that this is going to be a wall, let's do this. We can actually just land. Let's actually do it from this side so I don't run over the end and kill myself. All right. And we can build the heavy armor blocks as well. And again, I don't want to run over the end or the edge and kill myself, so do that. All right. And here, of course. Okay. So if we build let's see how many is this that's inside one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen and a pillar is that gonna be big enough or base? No. The answer to that. There. That'll do. And then we can come along this way for a bit. And it's not gonna ju just be a box, I don't think. I hope not. That's not the plan anyway. I want it to be a little bit more interesting than just a box. So... I think... Right around here, maybe? We will start coming in like this. And hopefully meeting up with the other base. So yeah, we'll meet up like that. All right. Good. 
how much uh, we do not have a whole lot of let's get back to base quick and fill up on some some hydrogen or we die I know I know that was very close that was very very close um, let's fill this up and if we're lucky or a couple more Oh, this is still going. Wow, that took a long time. But there are going to come a couple more. Let's just wait for those. We'll just take a second. And we'll have a lot more hydrogen to work with. We're almost out, out of iron ingots already, so we are going to need to turn it into a miner soon. Okay, and we can grab those two hydrogen bottles, fill this one up again, and there we go, and let's go back home base and continue our construction all right here we are so let's see we want to fill in this entire floor with light armor blocks. Are we there yet? Quite. Ah, there we are. Okay. And we're just gonna fill it all in. All right, so we're back guys. And yeah, I, filled in the floor here so this level is well the base is complete we of course need to f finish all the blocks here but i'm gonna build a welding ship to do that i think then uh, i also just built up a bit so that we can get a kind of an idea how, of how big this thing is going to be so up here We'll have a double floor so that we can have conveyors uh, going between the floors without uh, ha having to stick out and look ugly. And up here, we have, the well, the second floor is here, right? And then up here, we'll have the third floor. That's not as high as the others. And then we will have the roof up here. So I'm thinking that the first floor here, this is going to be the production floor. We'll have assemblers and refineries down here and H2O uh, generators and stuff like that. Uh, well, H2O2 uh, generators and all that stuff down here. Then we will have up here on the second floor, we'll have storage. So all storage containers and stuff will be on this floor. And then on this floor, we'll have the living quarters and the control center and stuff like that. And then on the roof, we will of course have turrets and we'll build up and have some windmills uh, or wind turbines. And we'll have some, uh, probably have some solar panels as well and stuff like that. No, I think solar is actually not that great in, uh, in this particular spot. 
So, and there are some of the places we want to go to. I don't know which planet is which or anything like that, so we'll figure that out as we go along. And I don't see our moon. There is a moon somewhere, which will be our first stop after going to space, I guess, as it's the closest. But, yeah, this is basically going to be the base. I put down the pillars here as well for support. And I think these are going to be a little bit bigger. It looks weird that they're so high and so thin. I think they're going to be a bit thicker. But we'll figure that out as we go along. But yeah. So I hope you can see the idea with, with what I'm going here. If not, uh, hopefully you'll be able to see it as we move along. I think in between episodes I am going to probably fill in all the floors and stuff so that you don't have to watch me do that. Because that gets real boring real quick. So I think I'll fill in all the floors. Uh, maybe not. I won't fill in uh, or complete all of these blocks. But I will put in the well, these things, I don't know what it's called. Uh, well, I guess it's some kind of scaffolding or something yeah, for these blocks. I'll put in in between episodes so that in the next episode we'll have a base that is uh, ready to, to go more or less. Uh, except that it's uh, it's only a, a shell of itself. It's not completely built, and we are running low on hydrogen again. So let's go fill up on that. And then uh, I think in the next episode we will start building uh, some of the little bit better... Uh, machines so we'll build a refinery instead of a basic refinery we'll build some um, some better assemblers and stuff like that so that we have all that ready to go and ready to work over there we'll also set up some power for it of course and set up an H2O2 generator and stuff like that so that we basically have the same setup as we have in the mini base only with uh, better better stuff so yeah so i think should look a little bit interesting at least at least when when it's completed I think, I hope, I really, really hope, so yeah, but that is going to be it for this time guys, whoa, 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 what's going on, I turned off my jetpack, <laughs> oops, So yeah, uh, thank you very much for watching guys, I hope you enjoyed it, if you did why not leave a like and subscribe and I'll see you next time.